Hey guys, Abby here, and if you didn't watch my vlog part number two, part one, you might want to go watch that first. Um, I'm doing a vlog again, and I'm making a strawberry banana smoothie. Things you'll need is a blender or like a magic bullet or anything that can really make anything. You'll need a cup. I'm just using my Starbucks. You'll need a banana and some strawberries. So I'm going to just need yogurt. I recommend vanilla. You'll need a spoon. I actually recommend like the bigger spoons though. Don't know the taste. You will also need some sugar to because yeah. So let's get started. And they're actually really frozen. And they're not really supposed to be that frozen. Like I made them yesterday and they weren't frozen. So I'm putting two, four, six, eight strawberries in. Well, maybe a little bit more because I'm going to make like a big smoothie. Your liquid base can just be milk. I know a lot of people say milk. So if you say milk, I know before I had like the um, really really thin smushy bananas, but they were actually really good in the smoothie. They were better than I thought. Um, in this video, I'm also going to be saying some shout outs because I was looking through my YouTube feed and I want to give a shout out to Megan Emily, 221 I think it is. Um, I don't know, I'll put her name in the description box below, but um, yeah, I was just looking through. So, this is how much you use that much of strawberries and that much of bananas. Use a whole banana, which I showed you the size, but I'll show you again if you forgot. They're this size, so they're like the bigger ones. So now you're going to... Add some Greek yogurt. I suggest adding like that much. Um, it depends how big of a smoothie. So I'm actually adding two times that. So and then if and apparently you can. It's like sour cream. Like it is the same material and everything. But yeah. So sorry if my video ends at all. My thing won't let me record that much, so that's why. Now you're going to take some sugar. If you don't want your smoothie to be sweet, then you don't then don't put any sugar. But yeah. And if you're making a big one, you want to put actually a lot of sugar in because yeah. So there's that. Then just add like a little bit more. And you want to be near an outlet and if you don't know what an outlet is it's this right there you do not want to put your finger in that because trust me I've done that so much times and I have gotten electrocuted and it really hurts I was like crying because it was like stinging and burning okay so I'll bring it down here so, right there no it's gonna fall so, right there. So you just want to put your lid on, and if you have one of those things that have the triangle at the end, then you want to match that up with your lid. 
make sure it's all pressed down. And again, make sure it's slicked up. So then it should have like things like that. You're gonna probably press chop first because you need to chop it. If it doesn't like mix good, if it's all stuck, just use your spoon and kind of mix it up just to kind of get it all started and get it out of the mixer just so then it's easier to blend. doesn't work I'll just end it and then I'll make a vlog when it's all done. <laughs>